Okay, let's write down the givens, and then we're going to go for what they want from those givens. So they tell me x is proportional to z. So I'll write down x is some multiple of z. And they tell me y is proportional to z. I'm going to say nz. From this, they want me to show that x plus or minus y is going to be proportional to z. Well, I'm going to say, let's see, I'll take another letter, k, z. And I want to show that the root of x plus y is, is proportional to z as well. Uh, it looks like a problem, doesn't it? But let, let's see if we can do it. I get another letter here. Let's see. I'm going to say Jay-Z. With the understanding that M, N, K, and Z are going to be constants. All right, I just don't know what they are. And we got to do this. So we're going to start with this. And I want to see if I can do this over here. Let me just do, let me just add them together. So X plus Y is equal to MZ plus NZ. So what'd you get there? You get X plus Y equals M plus N Z. what I just show there? Well, I just showed this part of it. I just showed the plus part. It's a multiple of Z. Now let's do the subtraction part. All right, let's see if we can do that. I can write that down now. X minus Y is equal to, let's see, M Z minus N Z. What do you get there? X minus Y equals Z times, I'm putting the right order though. I'm sorry about that. M minus N Z. What did I just show there? I showed this part. All right, now let's go to the next one. And next one looks complicated, isn't it? So let's see if we can figure it out. And what I got to do there, I guess what I got to do is maybe multiply them together. All right, so let me put that down over here. So I'm going to write that down for you. So x times y equals m times n times z squared. All right? All I did was I multiplied them together. That's all I've done. I've taken what was given and I multiplied them together. All right? So let's see if we can do that. And I'm looking at that. I'm going to say over here, uh, basically using a square root rule, I guess I could do that, right? So I'm going to say the root of x plus y is equal to the root of mn z squared. Now, there are some problems over here. I'm not going to worry too much about them. But what would you get over here? Well, the square root of z squared, if I had that z is a positive number z, root mn. Have I shown what they asked me to do? I have. What's the multiple? It's this thing over here. That's the j in the problem. So we showed this, right? And again, all the work is written down for you. You know what? Maybe I should put plus or minus down because I am using a square root rule. Maybe I should put that down. Yeah, plus or minus. Make it, make it more official. All right, that's what's in the notes, by the way. So we've shown that. All right? So um, let me just remind you who I am again. My name is Ron Bannon, and my email is Bannon, B as in boy, the at symbol, N-N-O-N dot U-S. And again, if you see some error in the problem set or some reason for concern that you think would improve the document, I'd love to hear from you. Thank you.